Camilla Duchess of Cornwall spent today 500 miles from the royal wedding as she visited a Scottish school, with just nine pupils. Camilla has sent a letter to Eugenie apologizing for her absence, but her decision to stay away prompted speculation of a rift between her and the Duke of York and his estranged wife Sarah Ferguson. Friends of Camilla have insisted there is no calculated snub, and her absence was merely due to an unavoidable clash of dates. She is fond of Eugenie and her sister Beatrice, and is very disappointed that she cannot be there, one friend told the Daily Mail's Richard K. this week. But others have claimed Charles and Camilla felt Prince Andrew could have been more helpful, at the time they were trying to get wider acceptance, of their relationship. Camilla's arrival at Critty Primary in Aberdeenshire was delayed by a tree on the road as the area, home to the Royals Balmoral residence, was lashed by high winds and heavy rain. She was given a tour of the school, before visiting a new games pavilion in nearby Brahma. It is understood that Friday's invitation was a long-standing one and Camilla, did not want to let the school children down. After apologizing for her late arrival, she told her guides, 11-year-old Logan Beedy and Zara Jones, it's nice and blowy outside, isn't it? Camilla, who is known as the Duchess of Roths in Scotland shared her love of the local area and its wildlife with the pupils. She said she had never seen a capercaillie, but had been fortunate to see some golden eagles, telling the children, they're wonderful creatures, they're so big. When they have their wings out they're huge. The Duchess said nearby Lochnagar was a special place, and told how she enjoyed cross-country skiing, because you can go for miles and miles, but it's very hard work. Camilla presented the pupils with books for the school library, and she received a posy and card from the children. The Duchess later visited a new heritage centre named in honour of her husband, the Prince of Wales, where she watched a display of Highland dancing, by 24-year-old Rachel Walker from Fettercorn, Aberdeenshire. The Duke of Roth's Highland Games Pavilion is situated in the Princess Royal, and Duke of Fife Memorial Park where the world-famous Brahma gathering is held every September, and regularly attended by the Queen. The centre, which will open to the public next spring, tells the story of Scotland's Highland Games, and is the new headquarters of the Brahma Royal Highland Society, organisers of the gathering. Camilla admired a map of the site dating, from 1906, and met members of the society and staff of the Prince's Foundation a charity founded by Charles which was involved in the building's construction. David Geddes, president of the Bremer Royal Highland Society, said, when the building was unveiled to Her Majesty the Queen and the Duke of Roths, during the Bremer gathering, the Duchess was unable to attend due to prior commitments. However, we are delighted she has been able to see the building for herself, and we look forward to welcoming her back in future. He added, our hope is that people will come and visit when they are on holiday, and because they've been here they'll be inspired to go to Highland Games around Scotland. Robert Lovey of the Prince's Foundation said, It was a pleasure to welcome the Duchess of Roths to Bramah, for her to see firsthand the completed Duke of Roths Highland Games Pavilion. She was enthusiastic about the building's beauty, the value of its purpose, and its ability to fit seamlessly into the surroundings.